Hi Love Cell and welcome back to my channel and thank you so much for being here today. I am going to be talking all about my absolute favorite products for the body. Yes, and I actually have never really done anything like this. So if you want more videos like this, please comment below and I would love to do them for you. So before we get started, hit the subscribe button, share this video with somebody you think might like it, and let's do it. I first want to start off by saying thank you so much to today's sponsor. It is Necessaire. It is an amazing, cruelty-free, very vitamin-rich body line. Now, I have honestly been using this for the past year. Um, if you follow me on Instagram, or if you don't, I don't know why you don't, <laughs> but I share a lot more things over there that I don't share on this channel. But I have shared that I use this body product on myself and actually my daughter. And that's kind of a kind of what got into this video is that I have been using this forever. They reached out and I said, oh my God, I have an amazing story. Of course, I would love to partner with you. So thank you so much. Now, the one thing I will start with is the body lotion, but I'll get more into it because I want to show you what I do for my routine on my skin, on my body. So first of all, this brand is all about really combining great skincare ingredients into great products. And they have all things from a body wash, um, what they call a gommage, which we'll go get to, of course, a uh, body lotion as well. Now, my daughter, when she was on keto, um, she couldn't have any fragrance in her products. So none, no, you know, she had to have a specific toothpaste, and she had to have specific um, body products, shampoos, you know, washes, things of that nature. Now. I went to the store and I found some stuff. I wasn't super happy with them um, because they just didn't feed the skin how I knew she needed to be. And so I went through my products and obviously I reached for this line. It's what she used and continues to use. I'm trying my best to take fragrance out of my body products. You know for years I have loved uh, things like Josie Moran's body butters as well as the Philosophy body washes. But just with all the research coming out, really trying Trying to take fragrance out of my body products. So to start, their whole line that I use is fragrance free. That was my point. So that's what we now use. That's what she uses. And that's what I continue to use. So when I get into the shower, of course, I am going to wash my body. All right. And this is their multivitamin clean, nourish and balance. This has um, a multivitamin complex in here and you just basically use it on loofah and you wash your body. It's very, very nice. My husband actually uses the sandalwood version of this. It's a little bit more masculine and he likes a little bit of scent. So he uses the sandalwood version of it. He likes it a lot because it's very clean and doesn't leave your skin feeling weird. Um, and then I go in once or twice a week with this gommage. Now what gommage basically means is this type of exfoliation. Um, this has glycolic acid in it, salicylic acid in it, lactic acid in it. It also has uh, bamboo charcoal in it. And it also has a peptide complex in it as well. So it's feeding the skin. Now this is something newer to me. I've only used this for the past, I'd say a couple of months. I've been noticing with my KP, if you you guys don't know what KP is, I have it on the back of my arms. I actually had it on my face for a long time. KP is keratosis pilaris, and that is a buildup of skin, like extra dead skin, and it builds like chicken skin on the back of your arms. You can have it on your legs, really anywhere. Um, and it took me a long time to find products that really worked. Now, body acids or products that have acids or foliation in it are the way to go to get KP under control. There's one more step that I do once a month and I'll share with it with you in just one second. Um, but the body, the body exfoliator is fantastic. It's gentle um, and it really, really, really kind of helps with crepey skin. It has a hydrating property to it as well. Um, and so it doesn't feel overly dry. I live in Colorado, so the skin on the body can feel a little extra dry because of the lack of um, humidity. But I have loved this one. It's really a staple now. A little goes a long way. It foams up into this really amazing kind of um, body exfoliator. And you know that glycolic acid, lactic acid, and a couple others are really great for crepey skin, aging skin, dry skin, and of course, keratosis pilaris, which is what I've suffered from. Now, I will get out of the shower. I will towel off. And this is maybe once... I'd say maybe once or twice a month, okay, at most. 
When I was younger, to get rid of my keratosis pilaris, I would go in for microdermabrasion, okay? Now, I have an at-home kit that I have talked to you about, this bad boy right here. I will link it below. I'll link everything below. Um, this is by a company called TS, and it is an at-home microdermabrasion. It's called, I said TS, but it's trophy skin. That's, whoop, that's what's going on here. Um, it's extremely effective. Now, I always caution you with one of these, please don't use this on your face more than once a month. I mean, go to professional. Honestly, I just, I have to put that out there. But if you already have one and feel weird about using it on your face and might have keratosis pilaris on your body, this is fantastic to use once a month on the back of my arm. So literally I'll just go like this, like that. And I now no longer suffer with keratosis pilaris. This has kept it under control. All of these products have kept my keratosis pilaris under control. I am so grateful because it was really an, an issue for me. It was something that I have been teased about for a long time in my life. Um, I know that I am also treating it internally because it's also a sign of food allergies and gut health. So we can talk about that at another point you know, another time. Um, but I use those and really honestly has helped so dramatically. It's great for back acne as well. Same with this gommage uh, from Necessaire. Um, they, that would be great for back acne, the fragrance free version of that. And then I literally finish up every single morning and every single night with their body lotion. Um, this is also gonna strengthen the skin barrier on your body. You know, a lot of us don't take care of the skin from here down like we would on our face. And as we know, the skin is the largest organ on our body, is the largest organ of our body, and it needs to be taken care of. And this is how I choose to do it. So this again is the fragrance-free version. It has um, it's very, very fast absorbing and that's what I like because I don't like putting jeans or leggings on when your skin feels all slimy from lotion. It bothers me. So um, this is really, really fast absorbing, which I love. Um, it has a multivitamin complex in it as well and it has vitamin, their multivitamin complex is vitamin A. So you're getting your vitamin A in your body, which is fantastic. Vitamin B3, again, the ABCs of skincare. Vitamin C, again, uh, vitamin E, omega-6, omega-9, and it has an antioxidant complex as well. I just think for, and, and this lasts you forever. Um, so I feel good about using it on my body. I feel great about using it on Gray's body. She's getting all the things that she needs. Um, she also has KP on there and on her back of her arms. And um, so we don't use the body exfoliator on her, by the way, just the body wash and the lotion. So that is how I take care of my keratosis pilaris. And as I'm aging, I'm noticing I'm getting a little bit more crepey skin. These have kept it at bay. All right, so now since we are going into the more warmer months, which hopefully I'm like pushing that energy out because there's like a foot of snow outside of my house right now, is I use this guy. This is the Island, um, Island or Isley, Isley of Paradise. Um, it is something that I bought at Sephora and it is a self tanner. Um, it's clear, it works really, really well. Um, this is the darker one. And I will do this after exfoliation. So after I've used all of my Necessaire products, um, I will use this after that. And it takes a few hours to kind of develop. It comes with a little uh, mitt guy. And it really is beautiful. It makes the skin look gorgeous. It's not orange. It doesn't feel tacky on the skin. Um, really great brand. Uh, of course, cruelty free as well. And it is beautiful. And I love this. And I've used this for probably three years. It used to come in a white bottle and then the foam was actually a color. And this doesn't. This comes now in a clear bottle and the foam is actually clear. So when you put it on, you need to make sure that you really go over places like a couple of times because you can't really see it. Okay. All right. Now, this guy I bought at Walgreens, and I have to tell you about it. Now, it's not the prettiest thing in the universe, but I don't really care. So moving to Colorado, we obviously run our heat a lot, and a lot of other places run their heat a lot. Um, we do have a whole house, in-house humidifier system that we've added, but I've noticed that I really need some extra hydration right next to my bed. So I got a humidifier. 
It's this little guy, okay? I put him right next to my bed. If you want something prettier, I'll lo list one down on, you know, on Amazon if you want to buy one. Um, but it doesn't, but I literally, you clean this out every single time you use it. I put it under my sink, let it dry out, and then I use it the next day. I actually will use it once or twice a week in the summer just to give that extra added glow. But I really attribute a lot of my skin health, uh, besides the great products that I'm using and really working on internal health as well, but to this little guy at night because it just constantly delivers... Um, uh, hydration in a kind of mist form. This is a cool air uh, or cool mist humidifier. Um, and that is what you need, in my opinion. That's what you need. All right. So this I love. It's a must. I will find the brand and I will put it underneath uh, in the description box as well. But if you guys are not sleeping with some sort of humidifier next to you, it's really going to really add. Um, a great moisture to the air as well and so it's going to really help you with that dry skin also for my oily skin girls it's going to try to even out that skin because the skin is going to be getting hydration from the air all of that good stuff now my last two this is something that i consider part of the body i actually have a whole video i'm working on with all of my kind of plant-based more green-based eco-friendly products that i use for the house and this one is one of the ones i use for my body this is by a company um, called Apres, A-P-E, A-P-R-E-S, Apres. Um, I wish brands would make their names like easier to like pronounce. <laughs> Um, but this is the sea salt chocolate. Uh, they they don't pay me to say this. I literally buy it every single month. It's on automatic shipment. Um, but this is a plant-based replenishment kind of drink. So I either use it as a snack or I use it as an actual breakfast. Um, breakfast is pretty hard for me in the morning with my daughter because things are a little crazy and busy. Um, I, this is one of the only flavors, though, that I truly like. They have a bunch of different ones. They have like a coffee flavor, any, all that type of stuff. But it has 15, sorry, 14 grams of plant-based protein. It has three grams of MCTs and then six uh, electrolyte minerals. So, it, and it's based in coconut water and it's dairy-free, gluten-free, soy-free, and 100% vegan. It is really, really fantastic for replenishing hydration in the body. Again, a meal replacement or a snack. The, let's see here, the calories is it's 170 calories and it's only, let's see here, if you subtract the, the fiber, it is nine grams of carbohydrates. That's not too, too high, especially if you're doing keto and you're allowing yourself between 30 and 40 a, a day. This could be good. So I love this. Honestly, you guys, if you're trying to kind of uh, get some more of that plant-based nutrition or you're trying to can maybe have a little bit more sensible eating habits, it's really a great company to check out for sure. All right. Now, this last one I'm going to talk to you about is new for me, but I wanted to bring it up because I wanted to get your opinion if you want me to do a whole video on it. I don't know how to say the name again. Is it Kenzie? Kenzie? Okay, so I have a whole story that I'll go into in story time about kind of how much I was teased for the body hair that I have on my body and what it's led me to do on a daily basis to not be teased. Um, I know it's a pretty sad story, but it's just the truth. This is an at-home hair removal system. So it is a laser hair removal system. I've only been using it a couple of times. It's super easy. Um, I'm finding it to be kind of good results. I mean, again, it's only been a couple of times, so you can't judge a book by that time. Um, but it has all the technology that a kind of spa grade product would have for, you know, I mean, it's not as strong as your spa grade hair removal, laser hair removals, but it's done in your own private of your home. And I've really been enjoying it. So let me know, comment below and let me know if this is something that you would like. Not that everybody wants to remove their body hair, um, but that's just something that I choose to do. And I have, again, been teased my whole life about some of the stuff. And so that's why I was excited to get this in PR. And I was like, huh, interesting. I might want to try that. So anyway, I hope y'all enjoyed how I take care of my body kind of inside and out. And please list your favorite body products below so that the squad can learn from you. Again, thank you again to Necessaire for sponsoring this video. You guys, please check out their products. They're a really fantastic company, Kind. Really do great things for um, body care and really care about the ingredients that they put in their products. So thank you all so much again, and I will see you on the next one. Lots of love from me to you. Bye, loves.